Good day, good day, all my Tropics family. How are you all doing? Hope you are keeping safe as usual and taking all your precautions. So, there are 1,913,410 persons on the voters list. Are you one of those? You can find us out by just going online and searching and you'll find out if you are on the voter list and where you are supposed to vote. As you can see, this is the breakdown by constituency, the voting population. Are you in it? I am going to show you how you can log on and find out that information right now. I will be directing you to the official site of the Electoral Commission of Jamaica and this is what the site looks like. It has a different different information that you can look up so you can just go on and from time to time there are other information that you can gather as well using this website. So let's get into it. I am going to do an example and you can go ahead log into your browser or as i am doing right now log on to google also it will be highly highly appreciated if you go ahead and subscribe to my channel share this information just in case someone want to know where they are supposed to vote or if they are actually on uh, this uh, new voters list so go ahead and share up leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you i am now typing in ecj which is the abbreviation for electoral commission of jamaica and as you see there's already that information popping up on the screen you just click on that and then it will direct you to the site that you need there you click on check my status and it will direct you to a page asking you for some information that's your first name last name and the date of birth so as you can see i'm typing in john which is the first name doe date of birth ninth slash five slash nineteen 78 so that will be the 9th of may 1978 then you see the information pop up showing the name the date of birth the occupation the constituency which you're in the electoral division the polling division the polling station that you're supposed to vote the voting address along with the voting location so this will give you all this information i do hope this information was able to assist you on election day all electors must wear a mask have their hands sanitized and their temperature taken electors must observe six feet physical distancing and remove your mask when instructed by the presiding officer so you may be identified you will be issued a ballot along with a pencil and directed to the voting booth Hand your ballot to the presiding officer and place your pencil in the box for used pencils. Sanitize your hand before dipping your finger in the electoral ink. Remember to take your current voter ID card to the polling station on election day. Current voter ID cards are valid until December 2020. If you do not bring your ID card, you must answer a few questions, be fingerprinted, and take an oath before you can vote. 
So, bring your voter ID card and wear your mask on election day. Topics of the tropics. It's tropics, topics, share up and like it, don't stop it, watch it, subscribe and clock it. Don't let it, pack it, it's trendy, rack it. Where, why, when, oh, just tropics, stop it. Topics of the tropics. Eh. Thanks for watching. Do remember to like, subscribe, share, and hit that notification bell.